only children believe in monsters. For those raised by one. There is poetic license in this, of course, with uh, with many of these projects, but a lot of it is what actually happened. Very excited to chat with you, Tony. Uh, for Grant, this how are you? Nice to see you. I'm doing all okay. How about yourself? You got some DVDs. You got some movies there, my friend. My goodness, fantastic. That's just a handful of them. I've got two other shelves throughout the room. I'm sure I you have. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I got to say, this show is such an interesting blend of comedy, of drama, of historical uh, fiction. What about the story really caught your interest and want to be a part of it? All of the above. That's a great triumvirate you said there. Yeah, the script, the sense of humor, the drama of it, the historical um, uh, significance of it. Um, unearthing these um, a little known monarch of a 23 year reign of King James, his Jacobean era, his relationships with the Villiers, Mary, George, they're all buried in um, Westminster Abbey actually. Um, and uh, it's I find it quite uh, interesting and compelling the fact that they were from a very low aristocracy, if you will, the Villiers. And the fact that Mary Villiers was canny enough, wise enough, uncompromising enough to uh, use her son in such a significant way that she saw the opportunity to um, to better herself and the family and uh, rise up through uh, King James's court by planting him in my court and uh, realizing would I bite and boy I think I bit I bit quite uh, a bit quite heavily and um, and became George Villiers became one of King James's favorites. So yeah, it was a, it was a great world to dive into. And uh, I, um, I think the script is what brings the humor. David DC Moore's lovely script and uh, the beautiful um, uh, words that we all get to recite, um, I think, uh, and the elements of it. I mean, it is historical fiction, but it was based on Benjamin Woolley's book, which most of that, all of it basically is based on fact. So, um, there is poetic license in this, of course, with uh, with many of these projects, but a lot of it is what actually happened. So um, a lot of the a lot of the humor and drama and the historical um, elements of the story are um, yeah, we're, we're all true. Well, and they're uh, explored so intriguingly. I, I can't wait to finish the show. I'm only a few episodes in. Oh, but, great! Uh, oh, it gets it goes darker. Believe you me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it does. And so with how important George is then to your character, what was it like developing a rapport and dynamic with Nicholas uh, throughout filming the show? Yeah, no, I think I've just speaking to Nick. I was lucky enough to, uh, to, uh, to, to work with someone who I think we both had the same sort of sense of humor. Um, uh, you know, Nick doesn't have any airs or graces. He's very down to earth. Uh, um, but we do, have a, we do have a lot of fun together, a lot of levity as well. And I think... Um, I think on set that that helped because obviously um, you know there's a lot of sexuality in the shows, a lot of sensuality. Um, you know, you do have to get your kit off quite a lot. We, we all had to uh, get in our, our birthday suits, as it were. But um, I think the, the way we dealt with that was um, was quite tender. Uh, a lot of the times, the relationship between James and George was. Um, uh, was one of first of essential pleasures, but then it went into sort of a respect, a friendship, and ultimately um, a, a sort of burning love story between the two of them. So uh, yeah, I had great fun working with Nick, um, but uh, I've also found within both characters, they're both vulnerable as well. There's a vulnerability to them. And I think the relationship within that um, really comes to the fore and uh, it's, quite, um, it's quite tender. To, to, to be perfectly honest, I thought, yeah. Well, even if the show gets darker from here, I'm really excited to see how that relationship. Oh, good, goes. yeah, yeah. So I see. Well, I'm sometimes we like the dark side, don't we? <laughs> some <Sometimes. laughs> <Of> human nature, <laughs> indeed. <laughs> but I see I'm out of time, so I will have to let you go. But thank you oh, so my much friend. for taking the time. It's great I to chat to you. Thank you. Absolutely. Have, have a, a good, good one. Great weekend. Bye bye.